Hello, this is Daniel, owner of ManyBidets.com. Today we are going to talk about French Curve Toilets. Now, French Curve Toilets are popular in older homes because of their low back and their French Curve. Right here, we can see the French Curve. Uh, it's a curve that comes around the outside of the bowl. So unlike a standard toilet where the tank is flush back here and just comes straight down and does not impede the toilet bowl, a French curve toilet curves towards the outside of the toilet bowl, making space in the back very limited. These French curve designs are stylistically very pleasing to the eye, but it makes for a tricky bidet install. Not only are bidet seats hard to install on a toilet like this, but in general, these toilets, because of their low back, don't offer great flushing power either. So there's a couple of limitations that you get when going with a toilet like this. There aren't that many of these toilets on the market anymore. Most of them are in older homes. But if you're looking at installing a toilet in a newer home, there are still a couple models of French curve toilets that are available. It's also important to note that when we use the term French curve, we're talking specifically about the curving around the outside of the bowl, like we see here. We are not talking about where the tank comes down and curves this way. Uh, now that can be a problem on some bidet seats that are a little bit less versatile, but when talking about French curve, we are specifically talking about the curve around the outside of the bowl. So I think, I've, I think we've clearly talked about what a French curve is. Hopefully that all makes sense for you. Let's go ahead and talk about putting a bidet seat on a French curve toilet. So you can see here our mounting plate. And this mounting plate has to mount onto the toilet bolt holes, and then the seat has to slide in on it. Well, this is a standard, very, very standard mounting plate. Well, what's the problem with this mounting plate? Well, it's square, it's large, and those French curves start right up in here on most French curve toilets. So you really have very little wiggle room to work with. So I can't even get this mounting plate to sit flush against the, the porcelain and get both holes inside of the needed window to install this mounting plate. Now let's say that by chance I was able to. What would mounting the seat on it look like after the mounting plate was installed? This DIB850 is actually a little bit slimmer in the back than most bidet seats. So you would think, I have a good chance of getting this to fit on the French Curve toilet. Well, let's take a look. So we're going to go ahead and put this on. And you're going to see that we don't really have a good fit. So because the sides of the bidet seat hit the sides of this French Curve, the bidet seat is not able to slide back far enough to clip into the mounting plate. So even if we were able to slide it into the mounting plate a little bit, this, this bidet seat would f slide freely and it wouldn't even be connected to the toilet. So bidet seats don't really work well with a French curve toilet. However, there are a few exceptions. Our favorite exception to the rule is called the Cascade 3000. Here's the Cascade 3000's mounting plate. Let's compare the two. Look at the size difference of that mounting plate. Look at the curve in the back of the mounting plate. Both great things when we're talking about a French curve. This gives us more room to work with. The length of the mounting plate says where it's going to fit and the size of the mounting plate in the curve in the back says how it's going to slide in and out. So this mounting plate can actually rest flat against the porcelain on 
most French curved toilets. So let's take a look here. So you can see how that mounting plate looks on that French curved toilet. And it's actually got some wiggle room. It's got some back and forth. Not a lot, but it has some back and forth. That, that's the mounting plate all the way back. So you can see we're looking at a half an inch, a quarter inch of uh, space where the mounting plate has wiggle room on this toilet. Uh, so quite a bit to work with there with this particular mounting plate. Again, this is for the Cascade 3000, which is our top pick for French curved toilets. Here's the, the Cascade 3000 seat. So what we would do is pretend that this mounting plate was actually screwed on. We would simply slide the Cascade 3000 into the mounting plate. And when we do that, we'll hear it click. Now on this particular toilet, you can see that there's still a little bit of overlap in the front, but the bumpers are resting on the bowl. You'll also notice though, that as we spin it, that it's able to sit back further than the, than the other bidet seat that we showed a moment ago because of how curved it is in the back. So this seat is more curved in the back and has a more curved mounting plate. And because of that, it can sit further back on this toilet, making it a fit. Now some French curved toilets will be a perfect fit. Other French curved toilets with the Cascade, you'll see some overlap in the front. This is one of those tighter models, you'll see some overlap in the front. Furthermore, even if you know the make and the model of your toilet, different years of the same make and model have slightly different stylistic designs, especially when you're talking about some of the Kohler French curved toilets. And so, we might say, well, most versions of X toilet, like the San Rafael, most versions of the San Rafael work great, but there are a few years that that toilet was made where there might be problems. So it might fit, but it might have overlap in the front or it might fit better. And all of that just depends on how sharp this French curve is in the back. Depending on how sharp that French curve is, we're gonna have a better fit or a worse fit. There's also something else to bring up. And that is on this mounting plate, again, this is the Cascade mounting plate, there's quite a bit of wiggle room here in the back. So compared to a standard mounting plate where it's very thin here in the back, and again, much wider, and compare that to the Cascades mounting plate where there's some wiggle room here in the back and it's, it's shorter as well as curved. There are specific toilets like the Jacuzzi Primo toilet, which is one of the few toilets made today with a French curve where this, this curve in the back is just too tight to install the mounting plate and si slide the Cascade into place. But it is close enough that if you were to take tools and cut out a little bit further back on this mounting plate and cut back a little bit further on the layer below to make the groove longer, you can actually make this mounting plate work for a toilet like the Jacuzzi Primo, despite the fact that out of the box it might not. So French curved toilets, you have the curve in the back, and depending on that curve, some French curved toilets will work with the Cascade 3000, uh, also would work with the Blooming or the Galaxy. So there are three seats on the market that French curved toilets can be paired with. Again, the Cascade is our pick for a variety of reasons and feel free to visit our website and live chat with us as to the reasons why. But not all French curved toilets are created the same. So this curve may be shallower or steeper, and depending on that curve, you may find that even the Cascade may not fit your toilet. So you may be looking at, um, if it's really, really close, like with the Jacuzzi Primo, you may find yourself 
cutting out a little bit of this mounting plate and then mounting it, and that does work. We've had customers do it and have success. Or you may find yourself needing to replace the toilet. Um, so if you know the make and model of your toilet, visit our site, chat with us. We are experts on the French curve design and which toilets will work well, which toilets won't. So come chat with us, talk to us about whether or not you have a toilet that will work well. Uh, but if it's not a toilet that will work well, we can still talk about replacing it with a toilet that would. Hopefully you found everything that we talked about today helpful and informative. Again, this is Daniel Johnson, owner of Many Bidets, thanking you for watching our video about French curved toilets and how they work or don't work so well with most bidet seats on the market. Check out our Cascade 3000 and how that pairs with your French curved toilet. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see other videos about hard to fit toilets, installation, troubleshooting, cleaning and maintenance, and a variety of other helpful videos. Thanks again and have a great day.